So here we are from 1 to 15, and we're going to rapid fire these. And right after this, we're going to look at so I think we look at some past paper questions right after that. So everyone has or have. Everyone, indefinite pronoun here. Everyone, just one group. Everyone has. All right, each of the students, remember, each of is singular, yeah? Each of the students is either, remember the rule now about either, either my father or my brothers. Remember, we're going to take the, the subject that's closer to the verb. So we're considering brothers. So we'll say are. All right, number four, neither my sisters nor my mother. Same thing here. We have sisters and we have mother. Mother is closer. So we're going to use the singularity of mother and we're going to say is, is. All right, number five. The samples on the tray in the lab. Five, the samples on the tray in the lab. The samples, that's plural, need, plural. Six, Mary and John. Mary and John. Mary and John. Two persons, so that's plural, play. Seven, both of the dogs. Both of the dogs. Both of the dogs, that's, that's two dogs. Both of them have it, neither of the neither the dogs nor the cat. So since you're working with neither, we're going to take the second one. We have A, B. We're going to work with B since it's closer to the verb. Cat is. Same thing here. Either the girls or the boy. Same thing. Walks. Same thing here. Either the boy or the girls. This time it would be walk because we're considering girls. All right. 11. At the end of the fall, come or comes, the hard tests. What is coming? What is coming? Rearrange the sentence. The hard tests come or comes at the end of the fall. So we'll reword it. The hard tests come or comes at the end of the fall. Yeah, the hard tests, plural, come. Subject here, the hard tests come. All right. A bit tricky, a bit tricky. 12, the slaughter of animals for their fur has or have caused controversy slot of animals slaughter one thing happening one issue one problem the slot of animals has yeah so don't be tricked into thinking that animals is the subject it's the slot of animals just like it was the presence of bacteria all right 13 the student as well as his teacher Ooh, this one is tricky Ooh, you guys are good the point here is the student. So we cannot circle this entire thing as the subject because we have as well as. So when you have as well as, it's not the same as and. The student and the teacher were. The student, as well as his teacher, was. Because we're still dealing with just the student. As well as means it's not really important. Just in parentheses. So we can eliminate. All right, 14. The hard tests. Oh, wow. I just wrote this sentence. <laughs> okay, the hard tests come. Both of my roommates has or have decided to live in the dorms. Right? Subject, plural. Subject, plural. So we need a plural verb. Have. All right. So I should rewrite each sentence in the space provided. Correct any errors. If the sentence is already correct, write C. On an August day, 1911, the usual crowd begin to gather at the is it Louvre the museum begins yeah I think so two the Mona Lisa is not hanging on the wall I don't see any problems all right I'm gonna move quickly hope you guys can keep up no problems there the Mona Lisa that's singular is that's good the security staff are confident in its opinion that the painting is being photographed this one's tricky isn't it staff here staff can be either singular or plural depending on how it is used. The security staff is confident. How do we know that this is a plural, this is a singular staff in this case? Is confident in its opinion. So its makes it clear that it's considering the staff as one group, one entity, as opposed to the individual staff members. Its opinion, its opinion. So if this its were instead there, then the staff would be considered um plural you'd be considering the individuals of the staff right so the security staff um is confident in its opinion its opinion um 60 minutes are all the time that the robbery and escape took even though there are many minutes it's still one amount of time 60 minutes is all the time 60 minutes is all the time um, it took, they took yeah we can say 60 minutes are all the time 60 minutes 60 minutes is all the time it took. Five, the robber team consists of a mastermind, a forger, a carpenter, and two accomplices. We know this is one team, so it should be consists. One team consists. A million francs do not even come close to the amount represented by the loss. A million francs, what is this singular or plural? These ones are pretty tricky. Are we looking at the francs? You know, francs, that's a currency. Individually, or are we looking at them as one sum of money? Of course one sum of money so we could replace this with um it it does not even come close or that amount does not even come close seven news of the robbery breaks slowly 
even though it ends with an S, is singular. So this is correct. Meeting hastily, a group of top officials are divided in their opinions about what to tell the press. So a group of top officials, is this group being considered as a unit or is it being considered as the individuals? Since they are divided in their opinion, and this is their plurality, it means the group is being considered in its plural sense in that there are many individuals and they're all thinking different things. So meeting hastily, a group of top officials are, that's correct, are divided in their opinions. Group is usually singular, but in this case, it's plural because the focus is not on the group as a unit, but on the individuals within the group. Forensics are used to help detect fake Mona Lisas. Forensics, it ends with an S, but it's just one field of science. Forensics is. It's like mathematics or physics. Physics is. Mathematics is. Forensics is. Adventures in Artful Crimes are a non-fiction non book. It's only too easy. It's only one book. Even though the title of the book has an S at the end, it's just one, yeah. Uh, we have a couple more, but we're going to just jump to <clears throat> some actual past paper questions that test our knowledge on subject verb agreement. This one is from May 2000, 2003, but it has appeared on much more recent papers. As well. So let me see your answers for these. These are past paper questions from CSEC English A. Any disease of the bones and joints which are due to deficiencies in a single nu nutritional factor can be prevented. Error recognition. Do you see an error here? Eliminate the extra information. Any disease can eliminate this. Any disease which is due. Subject is any disease. Any disease. Singular. All right. Here's another past paper question. All right. This one here. You may notice that the windows of the house next door, the man pointed out, looks like those of ancient cottages. The windows look windows look subject the windows plural subject needs a plural verb look of the two books good habits in spite of its size provides a deeper study of humans in their environment subject is good habits of these two books we're talking about one of the good habits good habits we have an s here however this is just one book, so it's a singular subject. This book, singular, provides singular verb. No problem, no error. Of the two books, Good Habits, in spite of its size, provides a deeper study of humans in their environment. Another past paper question. One of the admirable characteristics of the young is that they are not easily scared. Subject, one of the characteristics. Only one. So is is correct. Is is perfectly fine. The sentence has no error. T. Another one here. Another past paper question. The better of the two athletes claim never to have used the dangerous drugs found in his possession. Subject is the better. The better of the two. Only one. Only the better one. So we need a singular verb, which should be claims. So error is there. The problem with students is that they arrive late, gives no excuse, and are rude when spoken to. All right. The problem with students problem is that's good so far no problem the problem is they arrive late give who is giving no excuse the student students should be give so in these questions they're going to find multiple pairs of subjects and verbs problem leading to let me use a different color problem is that's fine students give Ooh, the trickiest one of all. Tom, the most talented of those musicians who need help, has promised to give his services free of charge for any worthwhile cause. He spent many, many minutes discussing this question with some teachers the other day. Let's break down the sentence. Tom, the subject Tom, has promised. That's a match. Tom has promised to give his services free of charge. No problem so far, right? Now, we get to something a little bit tricky here. The most talented of those musicians who need help. This is all one big piece of extra information. So Tom has promised, but who are the ones who need the help? It's not Tom, it's those musicians, including Tom, but not just Tom. So those musicians who need help, that's a match. Plural subject, plural verb, no problem. Singular subject here, singular verb, no problem. Therefore, the sentence has no error. Tricky one. So there are many musicians who need help. Tom is one of them and he has promised to give his services free of charge. Hmm? Remember, you have to break up the sentence and rearrange it if it looks tricky. The final one. <laughs> 
the final one is a joke. Peter half dengue and feels weak. This one is not even trying to be seasick level. Free mark on the paper. What year was this? 2021. Okay, easy. Peter is singular, so we need has singular verb. All right, that is that. That's that. I hope you have all the screenshots you need. Otherwise, you'll have to rewatch and review and take notes. All right, so that's the lesson on subject verb agreement for right now.